Oh! Oh shit! Okay. Zig and zag. Zig and zag. Zig and zag. Welcome back, everybody, to Subsistence. I'm an old guy, Gaming and in this episode, we are going to make ourselves a refrigerator. Um, also, you can see that I did a little bit of work, off-camera work on the base. I was in a situation where I could play but couldn't really record. Um, so, yeah, I basically added these stairs here. And the intent here is that we're going to build a platform out this way that we can then um, put some crop plots up and start growing some cotton in particular. So we can make the winter clothing. It is August too, by the way, now too. So we really need to start thinking about that. I don't know if I had the mass storage in place last time um, I recorded, but uh, we do now. So we got that in place. I also added another power storage and uh, we're running the Jenny right now uh, because we are waiting on, uh, we're waiting on 1200 power in order to make the refrigerator. Uh, I was, I also did get attacked when I was out gathering off camera. By the time I got back to the base, there were no hunters left. There was some pretty major damage to my walls, but no, nothing had actually broken all the way. Um, so it took a bunch of my nails and shit to record uh, to repair all of that. I don't know which base it is that um, messed us up either, but I'm pretty sure that we have hunters, um, you know, in this area to the east of us, and I think there's hunters up in the in the northeast somewhere too. Uh, just because whenever I go in this area, I, I, I see hunters around. I haven't actually located where their exact location of their bases are yet, uh, but we should do that so we know where they are. Uh, one thing I am going to have to do, though, is I'm going to have to move the BCU over to uh, closer to the front of the building uh, because the power uh, radius that it can handle actually stops right at the wall here. So we're going to have to move that which means i believe we have to recreate a new one and then destroy the existing one uh, we don't need to do that right this second though uh, because i'm i desperately need nails more than anything else really almost at this point in time uh, we're doing reasonably well on on food and all that um let's go ahead and eat a couple of these just to top off our carbs um and yeah we got two things of water there so we're doing good all right let's go out Oh, the other thing we really need to do is we need to get some animal fat. Uh, so we need to start killing low-level wolves um, because I'm almost damn near out of biofuel. There's a bear right there. Uh, it's kind of close. Let's see if we can ninja this building crate because it is going to have nails in it. Oh, good. And a thing of water, too, which will turn into blueberry water. Okay, so uh, what I want to do, uh, I, want, I, I have a lockpick, too, so it would be very, very good to find a lockpick or a locked crate. Uh, so we'll be looking for that and looking for nails and just doing the usual, you know, grinding uh, for the resources that we need. And I would like to try and locate know exactly where those hunter bases are just so we know where they are one thing i don't know of know about is how to tell the difference between the different hunters i know there's like alpha hunters bravo hunters charlie hunters etc but i don't know who's who i'm not sure how that works so we'll have to figure that out or you guys you know feel free to let me know in the comments uh how how to determine that okay so we saw, I think, a rabbit run off this way. Wouldn't mind nabbing ourselves a rabbit. We've got 26 arrows, so we're in pretty good shape on arrows at this point. Um, Where did that little bugger go? I don't know if I mentioned this or not, but it's August now, too, so we really need to be thinking about winter time. And... You know, that's why I want to make the fridge, because my plan is to stock it full as, you know, full with meat as much as possible and have that be our main source of food in the wintertime. Whether or not that's a good plan, I don't know. Uh, we do have 60 day years, and I, I'm wondering if that's maybe a little too quick, at least for, you know, my first time playing this game. 
so if it you know if we get into you know september october and i feel like we're woefully unprepared for winter i might increase the time on that uh, so we'll just see how things go because you know again I'm new to the game right so I'm not I'm just kind of figuring things out and figuring out the best way to do things and all of that I'm very much enjoying playing it though looks like that might be a chest over there uh, no yeah it is a chest Ooh, and yeah, we got a bear nice we got two biofuels, exactly what we need. Um, all right, so while we're up high here, let's just kind of scan the area. Uh, there's a wolf out there. We can go over to that other grub tree. Let's take a quick peek up here. There's a wolf there too. If that's a level one, we're gonna kill him because we're right next to the water and then we can wash right off. So let's see what level he is. Plus there's another crate there. He's a level two hmm well we could kill oh that is a lock crate all right awesome i don't think we could kill a level two with three three pistol shots we'd have to expend a shotgun shell but you know what he's right next to this crate i think we're gonna do it i think we're gonna do it okay Give us a bunch of fat, dude. All right, well, two pieces of fat's not bad, plus the steak. We'll take that. All right, let's go do this locked crate. Fantastic, man. Give us some good stuff, game. <coughs> okay, that's pretty reasonable stuff. We got seven proteins out of that. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. And a couple shotgun shells. Some ore and stuff like that. So, yeah. Uh, let's go ahead and go back to the base and drop off some of this stuff. And then maybe what we'll do is we'll start moving in the other direction. And, um, you know, see if we can locate those hunter bases. I will want to make another lockpick now, but I think we'll still make the refrigerator first. All right, let's just run past this bear. Okay, do we have enough power to make the fridge? Uh, not quite yet. All right, we're getting getting close. Uh, so we'll just go ahead and cook up the steak. Let's put the fat in there. And then uh, we'll put the rest of the night. It's really nice to have seven protein bars as a, as a backup. And eight of those is beautiful. Let's get that running too. Uh, we can make our blueberry water. Uh, so put that there, mix into berry water. Beautiful, beautiful. Okay, that can go there. We'll put the ores in here. I would be running this, but um, I, I'm, you know, I'm trying to build up the power for the other stuff first, so that's why we're not currently running that. This gives us enough iron to make another lockpick, even though we we already have more. Okay, so we got some nails there. Always a good thing. Uh, let's move that into there. Those can all go in there, and then I'm going to do the berry water now because we need both hydration and carbs. We'll put the magnums in there, and I think we'll hang on to these shotgun shells so we can kill another level 2 wolf and then still reload the shotgun and have a full, uh, full weapon. Okay, let's pull those off of there. And um, we'll grab those and put those in there too, just to keep that going. How close are we to 1,200 now? Okay, we're getting close. So let's just go out um, a little ways. Looks like that bear's going to stay over there. What level is he? 
He's a level two. Yeah, nah, I don't want to waste ammo on him. And uh, we're going to move in this direction and see if we can locate those hunter bases. Uh, we probably need to eat both of these. Yeah, that should get us really close to topped off. Okay, so we got a bear down that way. We want to go north east ish. East. North and east and east. Another chest here. And a building chest at that. Yeah, I took a lot of my my nails. Not that I had a ton to begin with to repair the base from that attack, so. We need to replenish that stuff ASAP. Oh shit! Okay. I think we just found one of the bases. They're really building too, man. Um, alright, so. Let's grab that, make sure there's nobody else around. Let's look at our map. Okay, yeah, so that's their base right there. Um, so they're essentially to, yeah, definitely to the northeast of us. Not su super far away either. Wow, okay. Um, so I think what we'll do do is the next time we get attacked hopefully we'll be able to kill the attackers and then we'll come to this base and see if we can bust into it and get the loots because right now I only see one guy okay let's go uh, move this direction there's a wolf up ahead and there's also a chest. That's a level three wolf. Nah. I mean, I don't know. Will a point blank shotgun range kill a level three wolf? No. Kind of right where we need to go. I don't know if shooting off a shotgun this close to a hunter base is a really smart idea either. I'm not sure if that matters or not. I don't think they're chasing us. They're just, they're probably tracking us, but not actually chasing us. Okay, let's go this direction. We'll grab this sink here. Go around the corner this way. Because uh, I've, I've seen hunters multiple times, you know, kind of to the, oh, look at that. That's a fisherman. I think if we kill him straight up, which we could, we could probably take him out in one shot. We're going to piss off the hunters, though. I don't know if I want to actually do that yet. Why don't we leave him alone for now? Oh, there it is. Look, there's the other base. Okay. Okay. Um, so yeah, it looks like it's this area here. So they're really close to the pond. They're just to the northeast of the pond a little bit. Oh! Oh shit! Okay. Zig and zag. Zig and zag. Zig and zag. Um... Let's see if we can lead this asshole back to our base. I didn't think he would have seen me, but he did. We're not hurt seriously bad. I think I'd rather wait. I think I'd rather wait on the health kit. Did he not chase us all the way over here? Asshole. Man, and I could have... I could have taken him out and I chose to let him live and that's how he repays me. Uh, 
All right, let's be ready. See, the thing is, is I've just, I mean, I don't feel like I am at the point where I can afford to go to war with these guys. I mean, if they force my hand, I'm going to have to, obviously, but I'm not so sure I want to go looking for trouble quite yet. All right, let's just look around a little bit. Yeah, there's their base right there. Okay, well, since I'm not seeing them, I think we're going to go the discretion is better part of Valor route and just keep keep on keeping on here uh, again because of our limited resources got a chest up here chest crate whatever you call it let's just get these resources built up so we can afford to shoot those mofos it kind of pisses me off but again let's be smart about this you guys let's be smart about this Okay, so we know where two of the three hunter bases are. One's to the northeast of us and one's basically to the east of us. So that's good that we know that. Um, let's start working our way to the west and just keep going after resources. I would like to find out where the last hunter base is. It's possible that they might actually attack us now because we were so close to their base. But I can't I can't stay in the base and hunker down. Um we we gotta get these resources, so hopefully they don't attack us before we get back at night, but if they do, they do. We just gotta deal with it. Time is not your friend in this game, man. Especially in the early game, and especially with the winter coming on. We want to be careful of mountain lions. There's another wolf. Let's see what level he is. And some strawberries, too. He's a level two. Um, yeah, let's take him out. And we can refill our weapon and still have a full shotgun. Okay, got a little more fat from him. Did I already hit this tree? I didn't. Um, I don't think there's any water really close by. It's too bad we couldn't just wash off in the rain, huh? We have to. We'll use one of our canteens to wash up. But let's see if we can get to some water first. Let's make a few things while we're moving along here. Okay, we got a rabbit. Oh, and a mountain lion, too. Shit. All right. Let's uh, go the other way. I'm trying to be mindful of not sprinting all of the time. It's just a habit. And, uh, you know, you don't want to run yourself all the way out of stamina because then it takes a long time to regenerate. 
and you might need to hightail it out of a location. Yeah, there's the mountain lion over there, so let's not mess with that dude. We'll kind of work our way up this direction. Continuing north. Let's go to this grub tree up here. Yeah, I totally think we should be able to wash off in the rain, man. Okay. Let's go this way. We'll hit this other grub tree. And, uh... I think there's a stream right down here that we can wash off in. Okay, there's a level one wolf. Let's kill him. Yeah, we didn't do a very good job of that. Um, better take that right now. And we're infected. All right, well, whatever. We got two antidotes back at the base. I should have, I should have aimed instead of trying to shoot from the hip. I think that's partial, partially it. Plus, uh, we weren't on real even ground there. End of, at the end of the day, though, it was just basically a fail on my part. So yeah, there you go. There you go. All right, let's wash off. Not that it matters because we're infected now, unless infections can stack, which. Ooh, I don't even want to think about that. Knowing this game, they probably can. We got some iron or potassium over that way. Just looking for some, um, some kelp. I think there's one there, yeah. There's one here, too. Nice. Get a couple of these guys. Do we have a liver? We do. All right, we can make another antidote when we get back to the base. It's always good to have a couple of those on hand. Okay, we have a sandstone here and a level three something over that way. Let's not go that way. Forget about the sandstone. I don't need it. Okay, where's our base? Back that way. We better start heading back towards the base because it is getting on in the day. But we'll go this route a little further to the east as we work our way back. All right, let's stop running. We've got a chest up here. And a wolf. It's a level two. Oh, that's a lock chest. Ooh. Yeah, I don't... I don't know if it'll still be there by the time we get back, though. Yeah, that's really far to the north. I doubt we could make it back, make a lockpick, and then get back here and get it before dark. It's not likely. Level one... Wolf? Alright. Let's get uh, back here just a little bit. Oh, man. I'm glad I thought to reload this. That's the way it's supposed to be done. And we got another liver, too. Great. So we'll probably stick one of those in the refrigerator and save it. 
And the other one will make an into another antidote. So bear that way. There's a little pond here. Let's check it out. We have a sandstone and a clam in here. Ups Daisy. All right, we got to go, man. It's getting dark. We got a ski daddle. It's a level one deer. Oh, uh, let's grab the iron. The other thing too is, do we have cloth? Yeah, we should make uh, another bandage. It's getting dark. Let's just make a beeline back to the base. The chicken's gonna run right in through our front door. Okay, we made it. Whew. Ah, man, that was intense. Okay, so let's put that in there. Um. The fat can go in there. We're gonna need to cook those because we gotta eat, and probably the chicken too. Um, now, I wanna make our refrigerator, so we need boards and that. Oh, and electronics. Okay, let's get that going. some stuff away while we're waiting uh, th uh, those can go in there and those can go in there those are medium I'm gonna eat these and these now let's put the rabbit on, and then all of this can go in here except for that and that okay we want these three things in the kelp and we'll make another one of those and then we'll get this liver in the refrigerator uh, so let's just put the fridge right here put the liver inside and turn it on okay uh, let's just take this now and that takes care of the infection we still have two more in here so we're good to go there pull the steaks out rabbits still cooking uh, we just need to eat both of these right now and that uh, gets us pretty close to the top okay so you're still working on fat Let's turn you on so we can start getting some more power and we are going to have to be careful now of you know this is going to be consuming 20 percent <coughs> of well of one percent of power but we do have the ability to upgrade it we just have to get the rope and bank all that stuff i have i don't have any rope and i don't have the stuff i need to make it though so we'll just have to keep looking for that stuff all right you guys i think we're we're in pretty damn good shape. We want to make another one of these, so we're going to have to wait for our mass and power to get back up. So we'll do that. Uh, we want to start thinking about making these guys too. And we're going to have to move our BCU out to here uh, in order to extend the range for our crop plots. 
I'm also going to want to make some more... Um, that can go in there. I want to make some more canteens because we're going to need lots of water for the plots. And that's where it's going to really turn out to be a huge pain in our butt from you know for being so far away from water but you know it's it's the decision we made and we're gonna make the best of it for now it's not like you can just easily pick up and move somewhere else in this game it's just doesn't work that way all right let's take um let's take no right click four of those and we'll eat them and that should get our carbs up uh, we need to drink too so let's do that and I think we're in reasonably good shape oh we want to make some more of the another health kit but we're shy one freaking oil damn it okay that means we're gonna need to we're probably need to go fishing um, so let's see what do we need to make the tackle S okay so let's grab some of those and some sticks and we'll do one two three let's do enough for maybe six fish here so yeah we're gonna have to go fishing in the morning uh, so we can get some more oil grab those and just keep this sucker stocked nice it's completely full put the extra in there um let's keep our rabbit meat no don't turn it off uh, keep our rabbit meat in there now that we have it and it looks like the sun's starting to come up all right, guys. Well, we're going to end this episode here, and then uh, in the in the morning, well, uh, in the next episode, uh, we're going to go do some fishing. I'll probably show you some of that, but maybe not all of it, and then uh, keep you know doing the doing the usual, and we'll go from there. Uh, our next thing that we want is crop a crop plot, so we have to wait for our mass to build up, and we have to remove the BCU. So we'll be working on that stuff in the next episode. Go away, bear. You go now. Actually, stick around in in case we get attacked. That way you can kill the hunters. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment and share out the video. And we'll catch you in the next episode. Bye-bye.